happy first week of spring. This week we are celebrating the Persian New Year and we are looking at the symbolism from this beautiful tradition of um, collecting things that will um, remind us that it is not just the spring in our world but it is a spring within us and I would like to remind all of you that as you had a spring when you were 12 years old whatever year that was and a spring when you were 20 or 22 um, 2023 is a spring of a new life and what would you like to draw upon and open yourself up to and be excited about as you come out of the winter hibernation darkness and into the light as we join our Persian friends and spend more time outside this week um, we can look at the symbolism of um, the beautiful um, platter that they um, have out that we'll be covering in the Dharma talks today I love some of the specific things like the vinegar was wisdom and the coins were prosperity and the apple was beauty and I, I started to think about all of those qualities um, and more on this um, beautiful feast from the Persian tradition. Um, as I go in, as I step into this 2023 spring, uh, what kind of beauty, what kind of a beautiful person do I want to be this year and how do I want to use my wisdom? My wisdom is so different than it was in the spring of my year of um, being 30 years old that it is right now. And, um, and what type of prosperity, what does that mean to me now to be pros um, prosperous and to be abundant? And then to just like open yourself up to what are your rituals? What are your, what things are symbolically um, important to you in your spring and will awaken you and, and, and open you up to your creativity in your life? Um, obviously I have um, some flowers that I planted outside with some in front of my Buddha here that are my spring flowers. And I welcome you to go to your favorite nursery to, um, to plant seeds and to do um, different little things around your house, outside or inside, or with your clothing to put away some jacket and maybe get out something that reminds you that summer is coming or spring, it's a colorful or something that is a lighter scarf. But to use this week to, to create your own rituals. Uh, this is a new year that we're celebrating with our friends and also with ourselves, the equinox, and bringing us into the season of our life. I'm reading one of my favorite Taoist passages translated by Dorian Israel about the caterpillar transforming into the butterfly. And again, it's beautiful and reminded to all of us of what an amazing miracle we are and how we are constantly in small big ways transforming. So join me for our Dharma Talks this week and celebrate the spring within.